Hello, and welcome to another video where today it's a reasonably bright and sunny day out, but you'll notice this is voiceover because unfortunately it's also incredibly cold and windy. All that said, I came out here to take a look at the lake. I'll show you why in a second. It does look like the ice is reasonably thick enough for some animals to cross. Those are some fox tracks right there. As for why the fox would want to cross the lake, well, who knows, it might have just been curious about something wanted to take a look. But that's not the main point I wanted to talk about today. A lake being frozen over in winter enough for a fox to walk across is not news. What is news, however, is how cold and windy it is out right now. You see, while I was filming this, it was about 18 degrees as a high and quite windy, and the night was even colder, which is why it's very interesting that the lake, at least part of it, has not frozen over whatsoever. In an effort to spare your ears from the wind noise that I've picked up, here's some video context of how windy it is. As for why this part of the lake hasn't frozen over, it's due primarily to the wind. This part of the lake generally moves quite fast, but the wind is making it move even faster. When water is moving like this, it has real difficulty setting up into solid ice. And in turn, the wind moving across the water causes evaporation, making the wind chill even worse, so watch out. That's about it for this video, although fair word of warning, it's about to get a little loud. Anyway, I hope you learned something and enjoyed. I wish you the best. It's really cold. I'm heading inside. Till next time.